We believe God's heart for the Billabong is for us to be like a water source that's teeming with life and a source of life to others. In our 20th year and beyond, we're expressing that vision like this, to be a thriving family of God, transforming our communities. That's the destination, and so the path there, or our mission, must be this, to live and love like Jesus. That's what we're here to do. In our 20th year as a church, we believe there are four areas of focus that will help us thrive and represent Jesus well. Our world, our local community, our church, and ourselves. The first three are important, but none of it matters if we ourselves aren't growing as disciples of Jesus. What does it mean to be a disciple of Jesus? Well, in short, it's to become more like Jesus. It's not a simple formula like engage in world missions, serve the local community, go to church in a life group, and you'll be a disciple. We can do all these things from the videos over the last few weeks and not really become more like him. But if we let them, these things can become valuable tools for Christian growth. Jesus loved God. He spent 30 years as a child and young adult getting to know the heart of God before starting his life impacting ministry. So how are you getting to know God more? Jesus loved his spiritual family. He didn't need them. He was the son of God, but he wanted to go on the spiritual journey with others and he saw the value in that. Who is your spiritual family and how are you doing life with them? And Jesus loved the lost, the broken, the hurting. He came not for the healthy, but for the sick. How are you loving the lost, the last, the least? Love God, love others, love the lost. The great thing is as we grow and as we are stretched in one of these areas, we tend to grow in the others. We need the three working together. So what about you? In 2019, what's one way you can live a little more like Jesus and love a little more like Jesus? We'll do it together for sure, but it starts in your heart and my heart today.